Have you ever wondered how purple onions are harvested and sold in the market? Well, you're in for a treat. Purple onions, also known as red onions, are a sight to behold. With their vibrant color and distinct flavor, they're a staple in kitchens around the world. But these culinary gems are not just about looks and taste. They're packed with health benefits too, being rich in antioxidants and beneficial plant compounds. The journey of a purple onion is quite a story. It begins in the garden where they grow nestled in the soil, absorbing nutrients and soaking up the sun. When the time is right, these onions are harvested with care, ensuring their quality and flavor are preserved. But the journey doesn't stop there. From the garden, these onions make their way to the market. It's here where they find a new home, ready to add flavor and color to someone's meal. Prepare to delve into the fascinating world of purple onions as we take you through the process from garden to market. Every purple onion starts its life as a tiny seed in the soil. And so begins the fascinating journey of the purple onion, a journey that starts in the heart of the earth and ends on our dinner plates. This humble bulb is more than just a kitchen staple. It's a testament to the beauty of nature's cycles. The life of a purple onion begins as with most plants with a seed. This tiny speck, no bigger than a grain of sand, is where it all starts. Planted in the cool early spring, the seed is tucked into the soil, enveloped in darkness and moisture. As days turn into weeks, the seed begins to germinate. This is the first stage of life for the purple onion. The germination process sees the seed sprouting a small green shoot, a sign of life emerging from the darkness. This shoot pushes upwards, breaking through the soil's surface, reaching for the sun's warmth and light. As the seedling grows, it undergoes a transformation, the tiny green shoot develops into a sturdy plant, its roots anchoring it firmly in the soil while its leaves reach out to the sky. This is the purple onion's growth stage, a time of rapid development and change. The purple onion thrives in the right conditions. It prefers a sunny spot in the garden and well-drained soil rich in organic matter. It's a fairly hardy plant, capable of withstanding cooler temperatures, but it does require regular watering to keep it happy and healthy. Eventually, after months of growth, the onion's leaves start to brown and wilt, signaling that the bulb is mature and ready for harvest. This is the culmination of the purple onion's life cycle, a moment that's both an end and a beginning. The bulb is carefully unearthed, revealing a beautiful, vibrant purple onion. It's a sight that never fails to captivate, a reminder of the wonders of nature and the fruits of patience and care. And after months of nurturing and care, the purple onion is finally ready to be harvested. A simple humble bulb, born from a tiny seed ready to add flavor, color and nutrition to our meals. The life cycle of a purple onion from seed to harvest is truly a marvel of nature. Harvesting purple onions is an art in itself, requiring a keen eye and a gentle touch. It's a process that needs to be timed just right, and it starts with knowing when to harvest. As the tops of the onions start to yellow and fall over, that's your cue that it's time to harvest. These visual signs are nature's way of saying that the onions have stopped growing and are ready to be plucked from the earth. Now, let's talk about tools. Some might prefer to use their hands, but a garden fork can be a great ally during the harvest. It helps to gently lift the onions from the soil, minimizing damage and ensuring that the bulb remains intact. Remember, these onions are not just food, they're also potentially the seeds for future harvests. The actual process of harvesting is pretty straightforward, but it does require a bit of finesse. You want to gently dig around the onion with your garden fork, being careful not to pierce the bulb. Once you've loosened the soil, you can lift the onion out. Try to resist the urge to yank the onion by its stalk to avoid damaging the bulb. Once the onions are out of the ground, they need to be cured. This involves laying them out in a warm, dry place with good air circulation for about two weeks. Curing helps to dry out the outer layers of the onion and extends their storage life. It's during this period that the onions develop their distinctive purple color, a sight that's as rewarding as it is beautiful. And there you have it, the art of harvesting purple onions. It's a delicate balance of knowing when the onion is ready, having the right tools at hand, and using a gentle touch to lift the bulb from the soil. But the reward, a bounty of beautiful purple onions, makes it all worth it. With the onions now harvested, the next step is preparing them for the market. A whole new adventure awaits, but that's a story for another scene. Before purple onions can hit the market stands, they must go through a crucial preparation process. Let's delve into this fascinating journey that takes the humble onion from the earth to the marketplace. The first step is cleaning. Our harvested onions are gently washed to remove excess soil and any potential pests. 
It's crucial not to scrub or scrape the onions too harshly, as we want to keep the protective outer layer intact. This not only ensures the onions stay fresh for longer but also gives them their inviting, glossy appearance. Next comes sorting. Here, we separate the onions based on size and quality. The larger, more robust onions usually fetch a higher price and are preferred by restaurants and bulk buyers. On the other hand, the smaller onions are perfect for individual households. Quality is also vital. Any onions showing signs of disease or damage are set aside. It's essential to ensure only the best onions make it to the market. Following sorting, we move on to packaging. The onions are placed in mesh bags, allowing them to breathe and reducing the risk of mold. Larger onions might be packed separately, while smaller ones are usually grouped together. This step requires a keen eye for detail and a gentle touch, ensuring the onions are packed securely without causing any damage. The final step is transportation. Our packed onions are loaded onto trucks, ready for their journey to the market. Care is taken to load and unload the onions gently, as bruising can lead to spoilage. The trucks are also kept cool and well-ventilated to maintain the onions' freshness during transit. With the onions prepared and packaged, it's time for them to make their way to the market. It's a process that requires care, attention to detail and respect for the produce. But it's worth every effort, as it ensures that the best quality purple onions make it to your kitchen, ready for you to create your culinary masterpieces. The final destination for our purple onions is the bustling market, where they find their way into kitchens around the world. Each day the market awakens with the sunrise, and the air fills with the scent of fresh produce and the chatter of early birds. Our onions fresh from the garden are ready to join this lively symphony. Setting up the stall is the first step in our market journey. Carefully we arrange our purple onions, creating a vibrant display that's sure to catch the eye of passers-by. It's important to showcase the quality of our produce and nothing does that better than a neat, appealing display. Once our stall is set we turn our attention to pricing. Setting the right price for our onions is a delicate balance. We want to ensure a fair price for our hard work, but we also need to keep our prices competitive to attract customers. So, we consider factors like the current market price, the quality of our onions, and the cost of production. Interacting with customers is perhaps the most enjoyable part of selling at the market. We meet people from all walks of life, each with their own unique stories and recipes. Engaging with customers not only helps us build relationships but also gives us valuable feedback, and who knows, we might even pick up a new recipe or two for our purple onions. Finally, there's the sale. The moment we hand over our onions to a customer, we're not just making a transaction, we're also passing on a piece of our garden, a product of our hard work and dedication. It's a rewarding experience seeing our onions find a new home where they'll be transformed into delicious meals. From garden to market, the journey of a purple onion is indeed a captivating one. And there you have it, the life of a purple onion from seed to market. We've journeyed together from the humble beginnings of a seed sown in the earth, through the growth and nurturing stages, culminating in the vibrant, robust bulb we know as the purple onion. Our journey didn't end in the garden. We then delved into the meticulous process of preparing these onions for the market, a process that requires patience, attention to detail, and a whole lot of love. At the market, we witnessed the satisfying culmination of all the hard work and dedication, the selling of the purple onions. Each transaction not just a simple exchange but a testament to the continuous cycle of growth, harvest, preparation, and sale. This process, while centered around the purple onion, is a universal tale of the labor, love, and dedication found in every aspect of gardening. It's a story that unfolds every day, in gardens and markets all around the world. The next time you pick up a purple onion from the market, remember the journey it took to get there. Until next time, keep exploring and discovering the wonders of nature.